This is Ryan Gem with SAE International here at the SAE 2012 World Congress in Detroit. Joining me today is Stefan Land, Vice President of Roof Systems with Antiva Products. Uh, welcome, Stefan, and thanks for talking with us today. Uh, first, uh, could you talk a bit about some of the main technology trends in roof systems and what's driving these trends? Yes, roofs has become a significant uh, marketing aspect over the last uh, years, actually. When we started with tilt and slide systems, uh, over the last years we have seen a significant trend into panoramic roofs, uh, both for large opening systems as well as full class panels. This trend uh, is really driven in all regions. Uh, we have like China, cars with 100% take rates, and this trend is uh, really pushing us forward in a lot of applications. Uh, there's other marketing trends uh, that are really pushing this forward. We do have, uh, with our technologies today, uh, solutions that really reduce and improve the packaging of the whole sunroof. So if you talk about panoramic roofs, the packaging is really critical. So you need to improve headroom, which we offer with our products, and of course, you want to have open space and uh, a big opening system. The other trend that we do see is modularity. So we have solutions that we offer to our different customers globally, which allow them to use and combine roof systems two or up to three class panels, uh, which really gives uh, an opportunity to our customers as well as the final customers to choose between uh, different solutions. Uh, the other technology trend is clearly on weight. So we have been working on this for many, many years. Uh, we were the first actually to launch uh, what we call a long fiber injection molding cover and frame uh, that we're still uh, combining now with our large opening systems. And last not least, uh, the uh, lifestyle and the uh, trend towards comfort with the different shading systems uh, either integrated in the class or offered by ourselves uh, is really allowing us to uh, offer our customers and the final customers different solutions that uh, change really uh, the marketing trend of, of those uh, cars that are sold on the market. Yeah, great. And uh, what role do roof systems play in helping the industry meet upcoming stricter fuel economy regulations? Uh, you touched upon um, you know, the weight aspect. Uh, could you, you know, talk a bit more about that? Uh, of course, the key driver on the uh, economic discussions at the moment is really the driving concept. Uh, however, besides this, uh, uh, it's really about weight. So uh, uh, we have, uh, with our solutions, uh, as I mentioned earlier, and are working on different aspects uh, with our technologies on weight. Uh, to mention a few items, to give you a few examples, uh, we're using glass, cinder glass. We're working on significantly thinner glass than what is used today, which is a key weight driver for those large panoramic and opening system. At the same time, uh, we are working and have solutions in place. I mentioned the LFI frame. Uh, as well as other compound or hybrid frames. Uh, we're working on magnesium frames, so really looking at other materials, uh, materials to replace what we have today. And one other important aspect is obviously to reduce components, uh, like uh, we have solutions in place where in the past we used two motors to drive two glass panels. Uh, we have one motor solutions today. That's also true for for example, uh, driving two different roller systems with one motor only. So all these efforts really help us to reduce weight, which uh, is clearly a driver to reduce and improve uh, economy. And uh, what are some of Antiva's main areas for advanced R&D? Uh, what future technologies can we expect to see uh, down the road? Uh, as I mentioned earlier, uh, the key drivers really for us are the uh, integration uh, and the packaging of the whole sunroof. So being a system provider that uh, designs, develops, and also has the technology to produce 
uh, the different uh, components and applications, we are able to truly give and offer a package to our customer that's unique. Uh, we are going to launch with one of our key customers a uh, new product this year, which will come on the market, which will clearly show those advantages on the packaging. The other area uh, is the modularity, which really gives the customer uh, different options, uh, combining it and using uh, you know, different shading systems uh, and meeting, of course, and exceeding our customer requirements. We are working on the uh, weight items. It's a continuous improvement area uh, that is driving us, as well as uh, looking for different concepts on uh, improving the overall function and, and I think that's new, uh, we're working together also with our interiors group on areas that combines really a lifestyle, comfort, lightning and adds really features into what is known as a you know, standard uh, sunroof today going into a much more advanced application for our customers and the final consumer. And you just touched upon uh, your interiors uh, group. How closely does the roof systems and the interior systems groups work in product development? Uh, could you talk a bit about the dynamic uh, between the two areas? Sure. Uh, we are working very close with our interiors group. Actually, since uh, all these uh, product lines are based in our headquarters here in Troy, uh, we have all our engineers that are working together there's frequent review on design, materials, and uh, there's a uh, an, uh, really uh, a huge uh, interaction between those groups, specifically on the engineering side. Currently, uh, we are working on two projects. One is on the material side, where we are uh, planning to combine uh, our knowledge out of interiors on the IP, on the systems, on the material, with what we use currently in our roofs uh, as a potential uh, solution for the fabric that we're using today for our shading systems. The other area of uh, uh, expertise that we are sharing knowledge uh, with our interiors uh, um, group is on the technologies, on the production technologies, where we have similar technologies and using the know-how the know of those areas and really combining this. So there's a lot of dynamics uh, working together and trying to use really and leverage the knowledge that we have in the different areas uh, within roofs and interiors and really make this a one interior, if you like, for the final consumer when he gets into the car. Okay. And you touched upon this too, but uh, how do roof systems and sunroofs and um, and other technologies that you're working on, how do they impact the interior experience for occupants? Well, if you're used to a tilt and slide sunroof today, and if you ever had the chance, and I would encourage you to really go into a vehicle uh, with a panoramic solution, with our solution, it's, it's a new, really a new way of an interior's feeling. It gives you space, openness, lightning, and it's not only for the driver, it's really for everybody that's sitting in this car. So uh, for those people that have family, uh, once that has ever had this feature, will most likely never give it away. Uh, we have launched our campaign, Connect the Sky, which really describes how we, as a roof systems, uh, not only delivering a uh, differentiator from a design perspective also for the interiors, but specifically offer a interaction, uh, in this case, with the exterior and connecting to the sky uh, with those solutions. So it's truly uh, a new uh, experience. It's exciting. And that's what we can see also from our customers that use this feature as a marketing campaign and uh, selling cars also through the different applications that our products allow them to, uh, to uh, add as a key feature into their cars.